morning pals, hope everyone's keeping well. So today I've got a very small haul from a couple of Arabian houses, which again, um, have come recommended and very cheap. So I wanted to give them a go and let you guys know really how I found them. So these were, I ordered these from Shaw Cosmetics, um, which is a distributor here in the UK. Um, so yeah, let's get straight into it. First one that I have then is from the House of Nibil. Um, this is Halabilicamis, beautiful packaging here. I paid around £10 for this. The packaging is amazing. This is a 100ml perfume. So you open it up, take it out of the bottle. Again, nice weighty glass bottle there, beautiful sort of lid. Pop that off. Oh, so this is a lovely sort of spicy scent. Um, for the price, I don't think it's too bad um, performance. So I have sprayed this already and it, um, I can still smell it and that was a couple of hours ago. So I wasn't expecting too much for like £10 say, but um, yeah, it's really nice. I think this would be good to layer in the winter. Okay, so I give you the notes in this one. This has top notes of now quite a lot actually. Moss, vanilla, plum, strawberry, Turkish rose. Bulgarian rose, bergamot, uh, cardamom, coffee, dried fruits and candied fruit. That's just the top notes. Middle notes now. Saffron, which you can really smell. The musk, rose, magnolia, jasmine, lily of the valley, sandal. Um, and then the base notes. Yeah. You can smell the oud, cedar wood, sandal wood, guyac wood, patchouli, white musk, vanilla, oak moss, violet. Yep, so that one from Nabil. Not too bad. Um, okay, next one we have here is also from the same house they built, and this one's called Golden Beach. Again, around ten pounds. Beautiful packaging. Pop this one off. Another hundred ml perfume bottle. Okay, this one straight off. Oh, it's lovely and fresh. Oh, I should say these two actually are both unisex. So. This one particularly, I know my husband will really enjoy it. Um, it's light, it's summery, it's very aquatic actually. Let me get the notes up for that one. This is Golden Beach by Nabil and that's again 100 mils. So this one is, top notes is green, yeah, marine, lime, bergamot, lemon, sage, apple, plum, grapefruit, Raspberry, pineapple, saffron, I can't really smell the saffron on this though, cardamom, ginger, coconut, violet, that's just the top notes. So middle notes now, um, balsam, lotus, rose, jasmine, ciderwood, cashmere, sandalwood, iris, base notes now. Sandalwood, white musk, vetiver, amber, patchouli, precious woods, oud and vanilla. Um, yeah, this one already, my husband has smelt. He's definitely going to enjoy wearing that one. And that was, again, £10. It's not bad. Now, guys, I'm going to be honest with you so you don't waste any pennies. The third one I got from Nabil um, is this one. Makalat Malaki. Sorry if I'm saying that wrong. I don't like it, guys. Um, I'm not sure if... This is a unisex fragrance as well. I'm not sure if um, perhaps I didn't read the notes properly or it's just not good on my skin. But again, beautiful packaging. This was £7. Bottle was really sweet. But guys, I there's something in this that I just really don't like. Never mind. Blind buys, you're going to have some hits, you're going to have some misses. It goes with the territory. Okay, so last one which was a hit, which uh, is my first fragrance actually from Armaf. This is Seville. Lovely big red box here. This um, aims at uh, ladies. So this one is again, Eau de Parfum, 100 mils. Comes in a lovely container there. And then you open it up and it reveals this bottle. Now, this was, let me get the price for you guys, this was £11.25 for a big 100 mils, and I've already sprayed this again on my hand, it smells lovely, I really like this one. The detail in here, I mean it's not, some people again love it, some people aren't going to enjoy it, but I don't mind it, I think it's quite nice 
for the amount that you spend with the detailing it's really nice okay so undo that you've got the armaf name there and then on the actual spray it has the name there too also the details are very nice so this top notes are rose orange grapefruit and pine um, middle notes are pink passion fruit and then the dry down on this is really nice so you've got here praline amber musk patchouli and vanilla and this guys this is a win because this apparently smells a bit like Givenchy's um, if Irresistible, which I believe is discontinued now. So if you like that, you're more than likely like this one. So this to me, out of the whole collection, is a hit. It's my, again, first purchase from Armaf. So if you have any recommendations, um, please leave a message in the comment below or anything that you'd like to see reviewed. Um, I definitely want to get some check out some more items from Armaf. Um, I've got a couple of other fragrances coming from some other uh, Middle Eastern perfumeries so watch out for those reviews coming soon. And again guys thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe, like and ask me any questions or leave any comments below. Alright, take care. Bye bye.